Hello, first grade. Are you ready for some homework fun? All right, this is bag 20. Bag 20 today, let's see what's inside. We have our homework journal, put that aside for later. Our instruction sheet. Ooh, looks like some game cards. A cloth eraser and a dry erase marker. So, this is what we are going to do. Every day, you're gonna play the game the same way. You're going to take out your number bonds and you're going to choose six cards. Six of them, doesn't matter which six. Okay, so you're gonna choose six cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, okay? So, you're going to use your dry erase marker and you're going to solve. So let's see, ah, 10 is my whole, my part is two, so that means my other part has to be eight, okay? Oh, this one I have the parts, but not the whole. I have nine and one. Oh, that means my whole is 10. Then, oh, I have two parts again, but not the whole, so I have four and zero, so four plus zero is four. Here I have four and three, so four and three is seven. Oh, this one I have the whole and only one part, so I have to be a detective and figure out that other part. The other part, two plus two is four. Then I have oop, two parts, five and five. I know my doubles fact, so five plus five equals 10. Now, I'm finished that on Monday. So I'm going to then record in my homework journal. So I'm going to go to the next available page in my homework journal. And I'm going to write the date. Where it says page, I'm going to write the bag number. This is bag 20. So I will write 20 here and then I will write Monday. So, I'm going to choose two of these to record in my journal. So, I'm going to choose this one. Five plus five equals ten. I'm going to draw my number bond. That was ten. And here's a part is five. Another part is five. Now, I could also do the second equation, and I want you to try. So the second equation would be 10 minus a part, which is five, equals five. So every time you're going to do two equations, the plus and the minus, for at least two number bonds. Okay, at least two of them. Then you'll do the same thing on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Oh, let me make sure I clean them off. Let me make sure. All right, I have them all clean and I'm going to put them back into my stack so I can start again the next day. So, if you're ready for a challenge, what you can do is create your own number bond. If you would like to create your own number bond, you can do it for sums greater than 10. Maybe you wanna do it for a sum of 12, or maybe a sum of 15, or what about 20, okay? So that could be your challenge if you choose to do that one. You can record them on Thursday in your journal instead of choosing the six. All right, now, we're going to clean up all of our things. So we need to make sure we put our instruction sheet back in on Thursday. We will put our homework journal in. We're going to put our marker back in, make sure that cover is on nice and tight. Okay, put your eraser back, close up your bag. Put your number bonds back in, zip it all up, pack it up, 
bring it back to school on Friday. Have fun!